I have a really big house in the hills. I know it's a little early, but after three weeks of dating, I wouldn't mind if he moved in with me. Finally, after what felt like years of uncertainty, the wait is now over. Darman has returned to YouTube. Dar Dar Binks is finally back where he belongs. And guys, he's come back with a vengeance. Roommate sabotages Valentine's Day date. What happens will shock you. Yeah, it's probably not gonna shock anybody. After all, it is just another Darman video. But what is shocking is the length of this video. I mean, my god. Darman's really diving headfirst into this whole buyout plan I think he's trying to scheme up. I mean, come on, Dar, Dar, making all of your videos 24, 25, 26 minutes. You know, the length of your normal TV show. I see right through ya. But because this video is so long, I'm gonna be jumping around a little bit. Don't wanna make this a 45 minute long Darman video, so uh, I'm not gonna. But with that being said, let's not waste any more time. Let's begin. This down with that. And then, oh, I need some, need some juice, yeah. <laughs> um, and then, I think it says a full. Oh, there. there it is, there it is. Done. <laughs> Happy early Valentine's. <laughs> you know, I, I'd give you one, but. Mm -hmm. You already have my heart. Sam, buddy, I've gotta be honest, that's gotta be one of the lamest excuses I've ever heard for being too lazy to make a paper heart. I mean, not that I've really heard that many excuses for not wanting to make a paper heart, but I have to imagine that would be up there. Honestly, the little things for me matter more than the big things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what all girls say. But what they secretly want, mm. is there a guy to go all out so they can brag to everyone on Instagram? You know, after three weeks of dating, mm -hmm. you still clearly don't know me at all. This seems, uh, pretty, pretty affectionate for three weeks. Like, they're moving quite fast. They had some history before this. I mean, they could have said, like, six months, and this would have made a lot more sense. I really don't understand why they chose three weeks out of all the times they could have. Oh, hey, Tara. What, are you leaving so soon? Yeah, I gotta get my nails done since I have no idea what this man has planned for me tomorrow. <laughs> well, you know, it's not too late to cancel on Sam here and be my date for Valentine's. So. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bye, Jeff. Bye. Okay. See, I still don't understand how she's with you, man. I mean, she is way out of your league. All right, so if you haven't figured it out yet, this is the evil villain of this episode. I like how they decided to name him Chad. I don't know if that's a little bit of Darman self-awareness, but if it is, I like it. Just, 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 just don't touch those. They're for Valentine's Day. Just, okay, dude. She's not gonna notice that there's just one missing. Yes, she will. Everything okay. needs to be perfect, okay? It, it's all part of my plan. You know, Tyra's got money, right? She's not gonna be impressed with something so basic okay well it's not just the strawberries okay i'm going all out oh <laughs> just ready <laughs> okay okay yeah. there take a look Okay, so to be fair, I'm not inside of this Darman universe, and I don't know the ins and outs of their relationship. And it has been about 30 hours since I've slept, so maybe I'm hallucinating the fact that they said they've only been dating for three weeks. Don't think I am, though. A $400 Valentine's Day gift before you've even been dating for a month is creepy. I think that would probably cause most people to break off a relationship. It's a bit too soon for gemstone gifts. I got this bracelet on hold for her. Okay, that's not bad. Uh-huh, and I saw on Instagram that her favorite flowers are lilies, so I got some reserved for her. And on okay. top of that, I got us a reservation at Giuliani's, <laughs> which is where I'm gonna give everything to her. Oh, that place is really expensive. Mm -hmm. Okay, how are you affording all this? I thought you were broke. <laughs> I am, um, which is why I finally decided to get a credit card. 
Okay, I understand that honeymoon phase where you're head over heels, you want to do everything for somebody, but Darman presenting this as, like, normal and good behavior is kind of concerning. Sorry, spoiler alert, but the only thing that ever really happens is that the girl ends up saying she doesn't need all of this. There's no point where it's implied that you shouldn't do something like this. I mean, this man is going into debt over a three-week-long relationship. That's like some middle school stuff, excluding the ability to get a credit card. Did you know our power's out? Oh. No, no, I woke up early to hit the weight, so I didn't notice. It's probably just out in the entire building or something. I don't know what you're so worried about. Because I was supposed to pick up Tyra's bracelet at night? The store said they couldn't hold it past that. Okay. Well, you're not even an hour late, so I'm sure it's still there. Okay, I want you guys to do me a favor and Google the nearest jewelry store to you. Tell me if it opens at 9 o'clock. I mean, them not holding it past 9 would imply they open at like 7 or 8. No jewelry store is opened that early. I mean, I get they need to move the plot forward and he has to sabotage it somehow, but at least make it make sense. I mean, just have him wake up at 11.30 instead of 9.30. It's frustrating because these videos could make sense, but it's like they don't want them to. Ah, yes, the vintage sapphire bracelet. Yes. Uh, unfortunately, someone just bought it about a few minutes ago. What? No, I, I put it on hold yesterday, so... We can't hold anything longer than 24 hours. I'm sorry, it's just our store policy. Can't hold anything longer than 24 hours, yet apparently he's been planning this for weeks and presumably would have found the bracelet a few weeks ago, which is also before he even started dating her, but he said he planned it for weeks, so that's not my fault. Blame it on Darman for some reason picking three weeks to be the amount of time they've been dating. I mean, I just still don't get that. You don't believe this. Martha's husband got her a Birkin for Valentine's Day. Okay, so? What do you mean so? All these girls on Instagram are getting these nice presents. You have me over here working all day. You better be planning something nice for later. Of course. Wow, I, I can't imagine why he wouldn't want to give you anything nice. You seem like a uh, real lovely lady. Complaining about not getting a $40,000 purse, I mean, seem like a great person. Let me box this thing up for you, okay? Okay, sounds great. What? Kinda... Julianis, how can I help you? Hey, I have a reservation tonight under Sam Guzman, but I just got an email saying it was canceled. All right, there's just a lot wrong with what's going on here. I know a lot of people praise Darman for his production, but the continuity in these videos is genuinely horrible. So if you read the phone, it's 11.30. Apparently it took him two hours to get to this jewelry store. But not even considering that, he gets an email about the reservation getting canceled, which I assume was sent right after it was canceled. You're telling me he couldn't get back on the list if he called a meeting? Immediately and said it wasn't him who canceled it. I don't buy it. There he is. Can I get your credit card? Yeah, yeah. What? Is there something wrong? It's, I, it's not in my wallet. I must have left it at home by accident. Hey, uh, I'm here to pick up some flowers. Name? Sam Guzman. I prepaid over the phone last week. Oh, just one second. Oh, here you are. <laughs> at least something's going right today. That's weird. It says that they were already picked up this morning. My God, Sam, you are really striking out today, huh? I wonder who could be behind all of this. Now, for some reason, they stretch out this bouquet sequence for like a genuine seven minutes, so uh, we're gonna skip to the big reveal. Can I take my blindfold off yet? Not yet, and don't try to pee. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right, give me it. Okay. Now? Yes, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> Oh, wow. Happy Valentine's Day. You made me flowers? Out of newspaper? Okay, hold on, hold on. I already spoiled the fact that she doesn't care about the nice things anyways, so I'm just gonna skip the already predictable fake-out sequence. I absolutely love it. Would you be my... Oh, you're here. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. I meant to give you a heads up, but, well, there was a slight change of plans. <laughs> oh, I can see that. <laughs> can you believe Sam did all this for me? It's... Uh, he's just so... romantic. 
Um, did neither of you notice that he's all dressed up or the fact that he, you know, has the flowers? I mean, are we really just going for the full-on clueless Disney Channel adult here? Come on, Dardar, you're better than this. You call flowers made out of newspaper romantic? Yeah. I actually got my girl real flowers, though, instead of... Oh, lilies, those are my favorite. Mm. Yeah, well, mm. if you were my date, you'd be getting me. <laughs> <laughs> I had to pay top dollar, but I like to spoil my girl. I like Sam. <laughs> you know, I gotta be honest, I think I prefer Darman's old style of videos. These new ones, it just seems so obvious to me that he's trying to appeal to some big kids network. I mean, every character is like, dumb, is the best way I can describe it. It's just obnoxious to watch. Uh, <laughs> can I help you officers? Are you aware of a power outage in the building today? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I thought it was just our unit though. I didn't realize it was the whole building. Really? Interesting. So you're saying you had nothing to do with that? Okay. Me, that, that, that is absurd. Why would I have anything to do with the power going out? The manager called us after she reviewed the video surveillance. What is this? Wait, you're the reason the power went out? All right, I'm not gonna make you guys sit through this five minute long outro. I don't know why these videos are so long now. I feel like Darman used to be a lot more efficient, but they found out he turned off the power, stole the credit card, all of that stuff, and then they arrest him. And in probably the worst way the video could have ended, Tyra asks Sam to move in with her after, once again, three weeks. Well, what did you guys think? I'm really not just trying to be overly negative. I feel like I come off that way when I make these videos, but I mean, Darman has seen a pretty consistent decline since I started covering him. It's like he feels the need to keep dumbing down his content more and more every time he makes a new video. It's getting to the point where they're getting pretty hard to watch. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and walk on over to that subscribe button and touch it. It's free. It won't cost you anything, but for now, that's all I have for you today. Bye. Subscribe.